Every major airport is somehow unique. Many pilots even think that every airport runway has a unique personality. And depending on weather and time of day, that personality can change. On a sunny day, it's one way, and in a storm, it's completely different. To help pilots adapt to all those runway personalities, Boeing and Embraer have partnered in developing a program based on a long-term strategy respecting pilot control. The program is called Runway Situation Awareness Tools. Excursions are the leading cause of aviation accidents in the past few years. An excursion occurs when an airplane departs the runway unexpectedly. That can happen off the side of the runway, so that's called a veer off, or an overrun, which is when the airplane goes off the end of the runway. Boeing and Embraer are providing customers with a suite of flight deck guiding and alerting tools, along with training aids and procedures for pilots to follow. The idea is to help pilots plan well ahead for landings. They will be able to determine a runway's specific condition in any weather, any time of day or night. Then, before planes approach the airport, pilots can make timely and informed decisions about how to land. Pilots are trained wonderfully. Aviation is the safest form of transportation. But there are always conditions that pop up that are unexpected. One of the tools shows enhanced visuals on the heads-up display. It includes approach planning, runway position planning, and stability and landing guidance. We had to be innovative because there isn't just one solution. We need to include the pilots, we need to include the regulators, we include the engineers to make the operating environment the safest possible. Ultimately, the pilot always retains responsibility and control of the airplane. But if this set of tools can help pilots reduce airport excursions, it's worth the effort Boeing and Embraer are putting into it. Collaboration is key. We, as flight deck engineers, aim to give the pilots the most up-to-date, real information so that they can make their own decisions. We want the pilot to be the first and last line of defense um, in flying and landing an aircraft.